Cardinal mentalities are the ones that are most troubled with it, and uh, the College of Cardinals won't like uh, interest and, and uh, business. And the Chinese, when they come up to the, uh, the world of trade, the Portuguese and the Chinese reached this point in around the 1550s where either one could have projected to become the world culture. But the, the Chinese had this uh, strong geometrical imagination that value was at the center and foreigners at the outside were less valuable and that heaven and earth were structured in this geometrical way that everything was in its place in a sort of Confucian hierarchy with, with uh, civil servants and, and writing and literacy that they backed away from the, this dynamical model of, of exploration and transformation and exchange. And so these tiny, insignificant little cultures like the Netherlands and the Portuguese and the Italians and then the Spanish began to be the ones who stumbled into this, this newer kind of economy. And interestingly enough, those nations that tried to understand the new world in geometrical forms with fixed values like silver and gold, the Spain, Spanish uh, 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 culture bankrupted themselves. And those tiny cultures that understood that an economy is such that the, the center of it is not really the center of an empire, it's just simply the center of a phase space. And so Venice is a little city, its phase space is an economy. The Netherlands is a tiny little culture, but its phase space is a world economy. Spain kept trying to deal and structure its economy as an empire and bring back all the gold and silver and hold it in medieval terms, and that brought about their downfall. So the real modern, create modernist cultures was the Netherlands and then England. So it's intriguing that when a culture comes into this transformation of value, its failure of imagination often uh, brings about a failure of its culture simply because it did not have the imaginative capacity to understand where they were. So this is a lesson for us as we, you know, are at the edge of this whole new culture and how we're going to navigate and handle it is uh, still, you know, up in the air. So who wants to uh, start off?